I always have to set a timer when I film because I always blab on and then the camera stops recording and then I'm talking to myself, which is always fun. Hey guys, it's Sydney. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, hello, welcome. Make sure to press the subscribe button over there to get updates for whenever I upload. I'm Sydney and you're watching a Q&A slash FAQ video. I do Q&As a lot just because they're fun and I like to answer your guys' questions to get to know me a little more and yeah that's basically that's basically it I reached to you guys on Instagram the old Instagrams which if you're not following me links always down below at Cindy Augusta go follow if you want to be featured in my next Q&A but I posted a picture telling you guys to ask me questions and you did and I screenshotted them and now I'm going to answer them for you it's a very basic concept so let's get started Okay, I really need to get a camera with a viewfinder because I'm like looking in a mirror that I have all the way on the other side of my room to see if like I'm in frame and I can't tell if my hair looks good. <laughs> Lexi Hearts Beauty asks tips for new YouTubers. I get this question so much and so I'm gonna give you some fast tips, girl. Here you go. Take some notes. This is gonna be fireball speed round. I could totally make a full video about this if you guys want me to, but I'm just gonna get you some basic stuff. So, good camera quality, it could be your iPhone, it could be a DSLR, it could be anything, um, but just make sure you have good camera quality and probably good lighting too goes hand in hand with that kind of thing. Make sure you have something to talk about and make sure you're unique and yourself because no one's gonna want to watch you if they can go find someone better who's doing a better version of what you're doing so make sure you you're unique and doing your own kind of twist onto whatever you're doing and make sure to be interesting that's a good one because no one's gonna be like hey I'm really bored so I'm gonna watch a video of someone doing boring things nobody says that so be interesting be yourself and make sure to have fun with it and stay consistent. Consistently uploading is key. And good thumbnails. I have a video all about making thumbnails. I'll link it down below. Self-promotion over there, so. Those are my quick few tips for beginning YouTubers and have a text message. I'm so bad at saying names. Okay, I think this is Denise RX Most asks. <laughs> Current favorite songs. I cannot choose just one, so I'm gonna share a few with you right now. Fetty Wap again, which is a really good one. I'll have these all linked down below. Nelly Furtado Promiscuous, which is kind of an old one, but I kind of love it. Ray Shremmerd, This Could Be Us. I'm really like in love with a lot of his songs lately. Ray Shremmerd Come Getter, which is a really get down and do your thing kind of dancing song. Daya's Hideaway, which is so good. So, 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 so good. And out of all the songs that I'm like telling you guys about, I would highly recommend you listening to that one. How High You Are, What's So Not by the Branches remix. I don't know. Again, they'll be linked down below. Check them all out. They're so amazing. I have really weird song selections. I go from like super hip hop rap like really badass songs and then I go to like super girly like cheesy songs but all these are so good I've been jamming to them they're like my summer jam so go check them out Nicole underscore 152 asks who are your fave youtubers okay I've answered this several times but I've got to say just like my top are my life is Ava Cali cosmetics hey girl what's up I love you Emily Dow again hey girl what's up love you Haley Williams she is the queen of DIYs. She actually started following me on Instagram, so what? Hello Katie, Maddie Bragg, Queen Maddie, Megan Ranks, Michelle Fawn. Yeah, now my phone is on the floor. Hold on. I'm back. Underscore Foreign Quivin asks, how to react to bad comments about your videos. By the way, I love you. By the way, I love you too. And I have a whole video about confidence that might have to do with some of that, but you can check that out down below. Again, all the other links down below. But reacting to bad comments, I'm the kind of person that just does not care what like other people have to say if it's like negative. I just like, you have to just 
like you don't know the person that are like you probably don't know the person that's saying the bad comments about you and it's like life still goes on and there are a bunch of other positive people that might be giving you positive feedback so try to focus on those more than like maybe the one person that's giving you crap. There are always going to be people that have negative things to say, but you got to focus on the people that are supporting you and are positive about like the videos or whatever else you're doing. So I'd say focus on the positive. Ejojo1999 asks, who is your favorite band slash singer? Now, I do not have a favorite band. I'm not like, don't, don't hurt me, but I'm really not a fan of like the whole One Direction, Jonas Brothers, Five Seconds of summer kind of band thing and I can never really have a favorite singer because my favorite song changes all the time and I have such a weird like taste in music that it's like all around so I can't have like one favorite but I really like I've always been a Taylor Swift kind of girl I don't know I'd say Taylor Swift just because I feel like I like the mo like most of her songs and it's like kind of like a consistent like I've always liked you and I will always like you. You can never go wrong with T-Swizzle. So I'm pretty sure that is all the questions I'm going to be answering for y'all today. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it or if I answered your question and if you have any more questions for me leave them in the comments below for another Q&A video that I'll probably do soon. Don't forget to subscribe by clicking the button down there. I did also get a bunch of questions about who the giveaway winner was for my 10,000 subscriber giveaway. So her name or username is in the description box of that video. So if you're really that interested, you can go check out there. But I did pick a winner and I did message her. Thank you to everyone who entered that giveaway. If you did not win, all is good. I will definitely have more giveaways in the future. So I love you all. I hope you have a fantastic day and I will see you in my next video.